You know, Fortnite is one of the only games that allows the controller input to be played at a competitive level, and is why there are so many talented controller players. You know, whether they have the best pump aim in the game, or have inhuman mechanics, I mean, these controller players all have a reason why they play so consistently. But your crush Tommy, where you at? Let's go, man. Your motivation guy is back, and these are the top 10 best controller players, and why we think they are so good at the game. And speaking of which, okay, our question of the day is this. Who is your favorite controller player, and what is their biggest strength? Let us know in the comments down below because you know we're gonna check them out all right let's get into this guys Here we all right guys so starting off at our number 10 spot we have a player who's been a controller legend since the start of fortnite and any game mode that you could think of man i'm telling you phase freaking sway is arguably the most popular controller player in the world and his legendary mechanics and top tier aim is the reason sway needs to be put on this list you know even though sway doesn't focus too much on competitive events sway still has managed to rack up over fifteen thousand dollars earned his grand finals qualifications are mind-blowing even though he focuses on content and competitive creative modes like zone wars and build fights you know, Sway quickly rose to popularity after showcase amazing tier skills on his YouTube channel and soon rose to be the king of creative, especially building related moves like high ground retakes. After joining FaZe, Sway was definitely crowned as the best controller player, even though he barely had any competitive achievements at the time. And so without a doubt, Sway's fighting skills are some of the best in NAE, and is the reason he constantly dominates other pros in arena, and even FNCS Grand Finals when he feels like it. With his skills and a bit more focus on competitive modes, Sway could easily be a top 3 controller player alongside Day and Miro. Sway is on this list not only because of his amazing achievements in creative like winning BFCs, you know, being acknowledged as the godfather of creative, and even in his recent placement, Sway even made money in the NAE Cash Cup during Season 6 with absolutely no practice, and an EU player on his team. Overall, Sway had to be put on this list because of his achievements and being the GOAT of controller players. Some of you guys have been sending me messages on my Instagram at your motivation guy about, you know, you've been trying to do everything to get better, but it seems like nothing is working. Well, let me say this. I highly recommend Pro Guys professional one on one coaching tailor made to help you guys get better at whatever area you want to in Fortnite. Our coaches are some of the top players in the world trained to help you progress as quickly as possible. So check out the top right of this video or the link down below to get started. All right, so next up in our ninth spot is one of the most underrated controller players, Who Fishy. So Who Fishy is known to be one of the most consistent controller players in NAE and definitely proves the controller brain dead stereotype is wrong. This man places in everything, guys, and sadly hasn't won any major events other than a cash cup with his trio Kaz and Aspect. This trio is known to be the most consistent and is filled with qualifier warriors who just can't seem to catch a break. This trio has some of the highest grand finals appearances combined right below Booga and Saf's trios. Who Fishy may not be the most flashy player, but be sure that this dude knows how to get the job done. In fact, Who Fishy holds the record of the fastest fighter in the world, man which means he finishes every fight he takes in record-breaking times. His peace control and smart plays absolutely confuses opponents, and he outsmarts them to the point where they have nothing left to live for. With over 90,000 earned from official events, Who Fishy is one of the only players who has worked his way from console to a T1 player on PC. If you're a console player looking to take another step into the Fortnite competitive scene, like you need to watch Who Fishy and his brother Sticks. Who Fishy proved everybody wrong, and he showed the world that console players can be played just as well as any other experienced PC player. Overall, Who Fishy definitely deserves to be on this top 10 list, and after dominating two different platforms and staying at the top even after stepping into the PC world so late into the competitive scene, like after all these grand finals appearances, Who Fishy definitely deserves to be higher on this list and, and really just needs a break from being cheated out of the top three. Okay guys, in our eighth spot, the guy who never has a trio, Extra Illis. All right, so Illis is known to be one of the best controller comp players from the start and has racked up a lot of recognition just from his placements alone. Illis consistently plays in almost every event with his fame starting from the FNCS Invitational. Illis racked up over $7,000 from just the qualifiers and continued to dominate cash cups. He won two platform cash cups in a row, won four trio daily cups, won another trio cash cup all in one month. Yeah, I just said it, all in one month. Illis started placing nonstop and never stopped. He even trilled with clicks and bizzle. Creo and Avery, and qualified for four grand finals in a row. 
After receiving his best placements and the whopping $90,000 earned from official events, you may be wondering like, why is this guy in the eighth spot? Well, the reason for this guys is really because of his recent placements and his inability to perform well with the set trio. You know, even though he qualified for the season six grand finals, Illa is split with three trios across the season and only managed to place in one cash cup. However, Illa still managed to win the reverse 2K cup with his duo slacks. All right, so let's just hope Illis sticks with his current trio as he deserves to place much better with the amount of talent he has. If Illis does very well in season seven, he's definitely a top five controller player of all time. All right, here we go. In our seventh spot is a player extremely similar to Illis. Scope is a player who dominated during the daily dual cups and FNCS Invitational era. Scope made a whopping $7,000 plus from just solo cash cuts before Winter Royale. And the reason Tfue chose to play with him out of anybody. Scope was an absolute controller maniac back then, and he still is. Scope bagged a huge $33,000 from FNCS Invitational and continued to win even more daily cups after Tfue retired from competitive play. Without a doubt, Scope would still be where he is without Tifu, and his hard work and consistent placements would make up for the boost that Tifu gave him during his early career. Scope unfortunately was held back by his trio during Season 4 and 5 at FNCS, but he made a comeback and he qualified for the Grand Finals once again with Tragics and Cease in Season 6. Scope grinded his way to over $75,000 earned from competitive events and still has a lot of players looking up to him. So without a doubt guys, Scope deserves to be top 7 on our list and is a very humble and skilled controller player. Scope is the definition of hard work and he practices his way into the big leagues with just his controller and an average PC. Alright, in our 6th spot is Fusion Esports Bully. Bully absolutely bullies his competition and has recently started getting a lot of recognition for his unique playstyle. With over $40,000 earned from Fortnite competitively, Bully sure knows how to put on a show. Bully has qualified for the Season 5 Grand Finals and has recently started placing really well. Bully dominates solo cash cups and has multiple top 15 placements in trio cash cups. Bully is definitely a player you need to look out for guys as he has just really started to really place well in almost every game mode. You know, all Bully needs is a trio up to a skill level and he can definitely make it to the top of the competitive scene. Overall, Bully definitely needs to be top six on this list and is an upcoming player who has placed very well recently. And our fifth spot for the best controller players is Netify. Nut is a really good controller player who has recently started placing phenomenally and has outplaced every controller player previously mentioned on this list. You may have no idea who Nutify is, okay, but just like Hufishi, Nut went from a T1 console player to a T2 PC player who has been placing in everything. Nut has made money in everything ranging from solo and trio cash cups, qualified for season 5 and 6 grand finals, and even won the season 4 trios FNCS on console. Nut has also had the problem of constantly switching teammates and even got so unlucky that he was one point off qualifying for the World Cup Finals in duos. However, Nut kept going, man, and is the reason he is top five on this list. With over $140,000 earned, Nut is an extremely underrated player that has definitely proven that he can compete with the big dogs. All right, so now that NAE has showcased themselves, we need to switch regions, all right? The player who definitely deserves our fourth spot is the number one earned controller player in the world and the most experienced, Woofies. So from placing second in the World Cup Finals and securing a million dollars, Woofies has proved himself to be a legendary controller player. Currently, Woofies is the only controller player in all of EU that can actually compete with the big dogs and just needs a chew that could just work perfectly with him. And so without a doubt, Woofies definitely deserves to be in our fourth spot, especially since he continues to really place in almost every game mode and has the pressure of carrying the controller pro scene in EU. Okay, so now that we're on the West Coast, the controller player in our third spot is Extra Reap. Reet is known to have the best controller mechanics and is the literal inventor of peace control. Reet absolutely rolls through the NAW region and is the only controller player along with Wavy Jacob that can actually call themselves the best in the region. Reet continues to place in every tournament and clutched up a top three spot in the FNCS All-Star Showdown. Reet's trio works amazingly with them and will definitely improve from six to hopefully a top three next season. So with the whopping $100,000 earned and record-breaking DreamHack performances, Extra Reap definitely deserves to be top three on this list. Okay guys, so for our number two and one spot, we just had to combine these two and there is nobody who compares to them except 
each other. Endless, Day, and Mero are definitely looked up to as the best fraggers in NAE and have controller mechanics that are absolutely unmatched. Both of these players have insane skills that led to their two FNCS wins along with their prodigious IGL, Reverse 2K. For example, Mero is known to be the best clutcher in the world and his aim is just outstanding and his smarts always lead him to just staying alive and securing the extra points that they need to win. Day is on another level of fragging and has the best shotgun aim in all of NAE. Many players even accuse Day of using cheats, but that's obviously not the case. He's just that good. There's absolutely no competition for these two and is the reason they are in our top spot. Of course, everyone has different opinions, so let us know which one out of the two you think are better as an overall player. Now real quick, make sure to check out Clix's new master course right now on ProGuys.com. We also have pro coaches tailored to help you guys improve quickly, so click the link below or top to get started right away. All right, guys, so we really hope you guys enjoyed this video and agree with our list. You know, each of these controller players have something that separates them from the others and is why this list was so hard to make. Let us know what needs to be changed and, you know, what controller player you think we missed that needs to be on this list. If you guys liked the video, you already know what to do. Subscribe to the channel and connect with me on my Instagram. Come on, what are you waiting for? At Your Motivation Guy. I'm the one that believes in you. I am your number one fan. I really mean it. Connect with me. I love you guys. Keep going. Don't quit. I'll see you soon. Peace.